Coach Bean, another great weekend. I'm kind of speechless. I think it's uh, six school records, two national records, few facility records. Uh, what do you have to say? Our kids competed really well. I mean, it's uh, we're leaving here feeling pretty good. I mean, we had uh, a week of work, and I really thought that we'd be a little, uh, I don't know, a little more torn down a little bit after the week, and a little sore and some of that stuff. But yeah, we still came and competed, and really, really had a good meet. And two national records is awesome. And Coach Wiley's four by four there that okay. he works with uh, just ran phenomenal. And uh, I mean, that's a big national record. And, Victoria Hill is uh, uh, 600, and she broke the 800 ATC record, and she came about a second and a half off the national record. So, uh, we've got a good group of kids, really talented. Okay, you, you kind of went into my, my next question, talking about all the all the records. Uh, uh, what, what do you what do you say about the men's 4x4, though? It kind of lived up to its billing, you know, up until the very end, kind of unfortunate for Latoy Williams. but. Uh, Oh, it was, and what really started it out was one of our ex-kids, you know. Uh, uh, Bryce went out and ran a phenomenal leg for Tech, and he pulled uh, Anton right with him, and, and uh, they let off at 46 mid, and uh, as soon as you get that first good leg, I mean, it's, uh, you're on pace, and it just kind of dominoes, and, and uh, every kid just ran really well and competed against Tech, and Tech was right there with us. And, uh, it was a shame that Latoy went down a little bit because uh, uh, we both ran with a 305. But that's a national record. I know that, that we've had our uh, eyes on for this year. And the same thing outdoors. We would like to break the national record there. And this group's got a chance to do that. Talk a little bit about Braylon Taplin, freshman. He, he really handled his own in that race. He did. Well, you know, you're talking about a 5A state champion. I mean, that kick and run. He's, uh, he's very talented. And, uh, uh, he's just going to get better. I mean, as he matures and gets stronger, uh, you know, it's hard on freshmen because, you, you know, especially when you're running with other guys that are that good, that are sophomores, juniors, seniors, and other schools. Uh, it just tells you how talented he is. And then the, the girls last week, they set the school record four by four by three seconds, and they're kind of setting a precedent by setting the school record by three seconds. Yeah. They did it again, 337 is now the new standard. No, oh, it was, and, and they ran amazing. And same thing, you know, Tech, has a good group there, and, 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 and we just battled back and forth all the way through. And uh, you know, it's it makes a big difference when you got somebody right on your shoulder. And, and uh, so we ran really well. And our anchor leg, you know, Janelle Redhead ran awesome. My anchor leg ran 53 something, and uh, just uh, was able to run her down. Any any final thoughts uh, before I let you go? Uh, just. Uh, you know, we are off next weekend, and, and, uh, and a few of our kids are get a chance to go to Arkansas. And we're excited about that because uh, that's a big stage, and we're going to have a chance to, to run a few kids there and, uh, in a couple of weeks and get some work in before we uh, uh, get a chance to run against LSU and Baylor and Texas Tech and some schools like that at that meet. In Arkansas, I mean, it's, it's going to be big, so uh, we're excited about a chance to go compete and do that.